The world I knew was quite simple. I didn't know there was such a thing as electricity or that water could come into the house through a pipe. I never thought about what I looked like. I didn't know what a mirror was. When you grow up in a community where everything you know is powerful and good and it's black, there's no concept of race that defines Cindy Poitier. So, guys, I am here on the gold carpet yes. for the premiere of Sydney with the newly minted Emmy you. Award winning, legendary, iconic, prolific Shirley Ralph. I'm sure I heard this interview that we did a few years ago that went viral the night she won. Thank you. Let's talk about who Sidney Poitier is to you because I know he means something very personal and very specific. Um, I we was both 19. have a Caribbean background. Yeah. I mean, he's a Bahamas, yeah. Jamaica. <laughs> Mr. Poitier cast me in my very first film, A Piece of the Action. Wait a minute, hold up, hold up. I have the line from that movie. Come on. I think. No, Stop don't it. say it. Wait right. But bourgeois. Uh -huh. No, wait a, wait a minute, can I just... See, people know the monologue. Wait a minute, listen, me and my sister were being babysat by my maternal grandmother, may she yes. rest in peace. She lives in the Benner Homes Projects yes. in Chester, PA. She loves Sydney Poitier. Yes. She propped us in front of that television boy, and we saw this movie. We had no business seeing it. We recited. Sherry Belafonte! Yeah. Sherry Belafonte! I love this. Please, yes! Right, you got it. Okay. I want to give you a Good to see you, girl. How are you? I'm good. Good. To see your Please tell your father I'm sending him a big hug. I will. Please do. I'll talk to him. He's going to ask me tonight. Oh, no, I know he's going to talk to him tomorrow because yeah. you know he's sleeping. So yes, tell him I said hi. Oh, a oh come on. Who's got a picture? Oh, Who's got the camera? You got us? <laughs> Yay! That's what you There you go. That's what I'm sorry. Okay, thank go you. Ahead. Let me finish this. So, we were going around saying this interview, I mean, yes. saying this monologue, yes. like in secret, of course, but you stayed with us. And we have been such huge fans of your career since we were like knee high to a grasshopper. So I just want to say thank you for being so deliberate, you know, and showing brown girl, brown skinned women of a deeper hue that we are beautiful. Absolutely. And you know what? That we are beautiful. And I never questioned that. I never questioned the shade of my skin. I never questioned that I was enough. I never questioned it. You know, my, my mother, my father, Mr. Poitier, that I, just the way I looked, I was enough. I was beautiful. Everything about me, wide nose, big lips, dark hue, gorgeous, wonderful. Thank what does you. it mean? What does this Emmy win mean for you? My Every, goodness. Everything. Let's talk about it. After all these years, I get what a lot of actors want, that trophy, but the trophy's not the important part. It's the fact that after all of this time, and I'm still the same person that I've, that I've been, people are seeing me. They're finally just seeing the work. And when people are able to focus in on you, now that makes a difference. Yeah. Yeah. We've, we've always seen you. Thank you. It's mainstream that's always slow to the table. But that's all right. It's yeah. on time for me, and yeah. I'm happy. Thank you. Bless Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye.